Squeeze reactions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We back, back with another Tales of Toronto. Mm-hmm. Like, comment, subscribe. Click the links in the description. And hit different. It do hit different when you hit the when you click them links in the description. The crazy story of one hundred. Mm-hmm. We gonna jump straight into this. Mm-hmm. Them, them, them Toronto demons. One hundred. Happy New Year, supporters. Before the video starts, right. fuck with this nigga talk about. Well, shout out to I would tell a little bro, like, yo, they demon in Toronto. They they stepping on shit. Feel me? Niggas think about Toronto, think about the Raptors and Drake and the weekend. Uh, shit get shit shit definitely a little different out there. Nigga that went to Toronto, fuck around, got boom playing around with <laughs> him. Uh, not expecting nothing. Not that. expecting that. Go out there and try to play it tough again. Boom. Jump into I this. want to take a quick moment. Thank everyone for 7,000 subscribers. The growth you. is unreal. I got some quality work cooking up, so be sure to hit that subscribe button. Shut up. 17 to 17, that kid's bang. Tumble right for his next shot. <laughs> Victim doovy. Victim. The police chief revealed some new developments today in a shooting investigators believe is connected to gang violence. Jake, big goat, man. Tell him I'm next up, man. Jake, make me for the drillers, man. I'm coming up. Make way for the drillers. Mohammed, Mohammed, a.k.a. <coughs> 100, is a Toronto drill artist originally from Mississauga, Ontario. His family relocated to Rexdale, specifically Jamestown, a.k.a. The Towns. The that shit look like the trenches. The shit look like the hood. Niggas be having a whole different image of a nigga's heads of what Toronto look like than what it really look like. Towns is regarded as one of Toronto's most dangerous <coughs> neighborhood and has claimed an alarming number of innocent victims. This is unfortunately common amongst some of the worst hoods in the city, especially Driftwood. Driftwood with a low side. Yeah, so when I really die, they just don't get that kind of love. I know him, I know him, I want to score with him. Yeah, come on, come on. The community guys can't be dying. Damn, niggas killed him. I guess he was probably the Charleston White out there, community activist. Yeah, man. Niggas killed him. Niggas niggas don't be jacking that. Niggas do not be jacking that. (laughs) I'm smoking, Sam. (laughs) I'm talking about Sam. Sam, well, you are the community that is in my blood. Well, you the community that is in my blood. So I'm smoking them. <laughs> You're the wrong block. Nigga, so you You're the wrong block. You should have been a community leader for my block. <laughs> <laughs> You're the safe in jungle. You're the safe in jungle. You're the safe where Hunter would have been beside you. The town nah. was also once home to the likes of YG. Who is sent- Nigga told him you should have been an activist for my block. <laughs> you should have been on my block. Oh, Niggas man. packed you. Nah, the activist is somebody who just stand up for the community. They can not yeah. nobody like Charles White. Charles White talked shit before he talked shit. He was activist. Drop the block along with niggas killed somebody helping the community. Nigga, that nigga, nigga ain't like Charles. <laughs> Both of which are rising. <laughs> Try to help them. As a result, many Rexdale rappers called them out, labeling them block hoppers. <laughs> Man, he go crazy on the ground. Why the map? I'm just so mad. I'm like, oh, I got a new ice on the No, 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 no. But they cap. They said they said they shot you. They said they wrapped up on the clock. Who's gonna shoot captain? Yo, who got the clock? My right hand man shot you. Prior to rapping. Honey was a decent baller, standing at six feet one inch. He would post consistent workout. Nigga's trash. I'll bust his ass. <laughs> I could do that a little faster than that, folks. Yeah, I'll bust his ass, folks. Videos on his Instagram, which displayed his impressive shooting ability. They probably had to slap. They had to slap, though. Hunted is also the cousin of Flipper and Century GGG. Flipper, I did the Flipper reaction. Flipper was a manipulator demon. Mm-hmm. He one of them niggas like a Boo Cracks type nigga manipulate. Like a tag. Nah, I ain't gonna say Boo Cracks. Boo Cracks was stepping. Free Cracks. Which are currently yeah, he's locked just, up for he's a step or two, but he's a step or two, but he's manipulating from a too. notoriously rough neighborhood, and with a bloodline full of real deal steppers, it wouldn't take long for Hunted to be introduced to the cold streets of Toronto. 
631 now, and Edmonton police are investigating a deadly shooting. It happened around 11 o'clock last night in a northeast neighborhood. Police say there were several others on scene who knew the victim, but they were not being cooperative. And the man that was shot to death last night has been on police radar. There's no doubt that this is a target attack. Uh, this is a, a group of individuals involved in uh, criminal activities, and uh, they're definitely on the police radar. This is the chilling sound of rapid gunfire erupting and it was captured on this dash cam video. After a short pause, another round of bullets with up to 19 shots fired. The target, a man in a parked vehicle. Global News has learned the victim is 27-year-old Abdi Latif Hirsi. A woman claiming to be his sister says he was recently laid off from his job. Police stress the man is known to them. Abdi Hiri, a.k.a. Sluggy, is a known dealer reigning from Edmonton, Alberta. Edmonton police indicated Hersey has been at odds with what they described as a criminal organization expanding throughout several provinces. Many have suspected the organization to be 100 and the G- You see how the news shit on you when you die? How the news saying we know gang member like, like the nigga, damn, nigga just yeah, got yeah. killed, bro. Damn, y'all gonna throw he a gang member on there first. Yeah, he's a known gang member that died. It's a gang war. Like, bro, say that shit for later, bro. Not right away, my nigga. God damn. Yeah, they want to stand your name and immediately. Media posts made by the crew since Sluggy's death definitely didn't help their case. Bro, you know what I mean? When I'm in the E, I'm off that Sluggy. Yeah. <laughs> what you guys know about when I'm in the E, I'm off that Sluggy. Smoking on that Sluggy, my nigga. Smoking on that Sluggy, my nigga. <laughs> This the rest of the piece that nigga slipping, shot him in the back. And when I'm in the staff, I'm off that clutch pack. And when I'm in the E, I'm off that sluggy. Movie, bow. Movie, bow. Nigga sound like Fabio. <laughs> uh, a, a Canadian Fabio. It would only take Edmonton police one month to nab for suspects in connection to the death of Sluggy. During preliminary Jeez. hearings, Edmonton police indicated that an abundant amount of video surveillance in a number of locations and good police work led to their arrest. They then announced two of the four suspects were 100 and Century GGG. Wow. CCTV evidence provided during the hearing clearly portrayed Hunted as the getaway driver while Century was one of the two shooters. Further evidence showed one of the shooters emptying their clip into Sluggy, returning to the getaway vehicle, reloading, running back to the body of Sluggy, and emptying another clip into him. Nutty. Investigators suspect... Doubtful, nigga. What are we at? What's up? We at 5.56? Nigga... You remember in the beginning when that shit started, the nigga, you heard the shots, bye, 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 mm -hmm. bye. Yeah. Stop. Then more shots. That nigga went to the car. Nigga, hit him up. Imagine getting smoked. Imagine getting shot, right? Bah, 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 bah. You probably still alive. You probably got hit four or five times. You probably fucked up. Uh, damn, what the... Uh, shit. You think niggas left. Niggas come right back. Bah, 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 bah. Now you done. Yeah, you done off now. You probably thinking off that five, six. Like, oh, shit, I'm hurting. Damn. Uh, they got me. <laughs> you probably still talking this shit. They got me, bitch ass niggas. Uh, then a nigga come back. <laughs> he say, it ain't over, nigga. Bang, 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 bang. It's over. That nigga knew it wasn't over. That nigga said, nah, I don't think I killed him. I'm going back. Nah, nah, nah. Hold on. Stop the call. Give me the. Went back and finished the way. Go lie. It's century. Hunter then drove the car to a condo in downtown Edmonton where the other two co-accused crashed for the night. Hunted and Century then fled to Fort McMurray, Alberta the next day, where they were tracked down and caught using advanced facial recognition technology. Nutty. Century's apartment was also raided, and found in the ceiling was a brick of cocaine and two handguns, while on the I'm floor of one money. of the rooms were the clothes one hunted was wearing during the shooting. Yo, yo a lot of uh, people say they bought for their guys. We bought for I our found them all. I pop all right there. Yeah, yeah, all the ops get overkill, my nigga. All of them. Oh, they all, all the ops get overkill. overkill. Okay. And you won't bail for a fucking homie. He said, "Yeah, we 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 we, we showing them thirty times." That nigga went crazy. They went crazy on that nigga Sluggy. Oh my god, all people. <laughs> This is a new shit too. Tim 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 
Baby, you see? Hey, yo, Kiri, go crazy on this motherfucker. I thought you were doing your same day, dead face. Sorry, Judge, I never learned my lesson. A few Sorry, months judge, after being in my jail, lesson. one hundred stepped foot into the rising Toronto drill scene along with his cousins Flippa and Century. He released his debut track, My Lesson, which did impressive numbers upon release. However, what really caught the attention of the fans was a diss track targeting rival block, Regent Park. The song titled FTO, an acronym for F the Ops, was leaked not too long after the release of his debut track and it shook the entire underground scene with its disrespectful lyrics and crude visuals. Many have suggested Hunted may have taken it too far, but that was nothing compared to what he would do next. Yo, shit crazy, that rap really getting niggas killed. What happened to this chain? You chain got took in or something? Oh, this nigga? Yeah. You know, he had the hundred chain. He went to jail, though. Oh, they probably took it when yeah, he got locked up. Yeah, probably had that shit on. Probably invest under Brian the fucking... You know how nigga police do. Yeah. I doubt nigga took his chain and they like, they alive. The way these little niggas is stepping on shit out there. To the release of FTO, hunted along with Driftwood rappers, YG and J Neat would take a friendly trip down to Regent Park and call out the ops, and the entire ordeal would be captured on an Instagram live stream. Regent and Driftwood have been at odds since Driftwood rapper 21 Neat killed Regent Park rapper Smoke Dog back in 2018. Since then, artists from both blocks have been at each other's necks in a violent feud. Oh, day, man. We're from Driftwood. We're not from Regent Park now. Get out of here. We'll pack you. <laughs> Nigga said, get out of here. We'll pack you. <laughs> Niggas will pack you up. And good evening. Edmonton's police chief revealed some new developments today in a shooting investigators believe is connected to gang violence. Tonight, two men face first degree murder charges. Matt Woodman joining us. that approximately 70 rounds were fired into a crowd. And police have revealed for the first time that those who were shot were innocent bystanders. <laughs> Superintendent Shane Perka describes this as one of the worst mass shootings in Edmonton history. One suspect is still at large. This was a mass shooting and this could have easily been 10 or 15 people killed in this incident. It was, it was that violent, brazen, and random. March 12th, 2022. One of Edmonton's worst mass shootings in recent years has just taken place. Edmonton police said officers were dispatched to her tail lounge around 2.45 a.m. after reports that multiple shot shots were fired. Upon arrival, officers witnessed a horrific scene. Around 60 to 70 bullet casings were scattered on the ground along with seven injured victims. Edmonton police reported that all seven people were innocent bystanders, including 28-year-old and... Bur this is why Tory as they won't go back to Canada. <laughs> So he yeah, asked they want to get deported. That nigga said, no, nah, that's a jungle out there, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit, shit started to make sense, man. I probably told him probably was a step <laughs> Boom that oh. bitch. <laughs> <laughs> he probably did boom that bitch. He probably did boom her. Where Tori from out there? He fuck with the low. George, who later died in hospital. Soon after the horrific incident, Air One, Edmonton Police's highly advanced helicopter, was in the area as the incident was shit. happening Follow and me. were able to chase one of the two suspect vehicles. During the chase, Air One reported the suspects began discarding firearms out the passenger window, which were later recovered by K-9s. After at least one failed attempt at making the car stop, police eventually stopped the vehicle and the people inside oh, tried to run away. Hit the but in the end, they were caught. Edmonton oh. police then announced 22-year-old Mohammed Mohammed, aka 100, was arrested and charged with first-degree murder and multiple oh, firearms offenses, no. while Saad Osman, aka Styles, was placed fifth on Canada's most wanted list. And on top of that, they added a 50k reward. Not much is known about Styles. You know niggas was getting a snitching on him. They started over niggas 50,000. 50 thou wow. Yo, for nigga 50 thou wow. You know niggas, is, niggas be snitching for free. Yo, that nigga, nigga, auntie start snitching on him. He over here in my house. Yeah, I'm hiding him. He down here. He's sleeping right now. <laughs> but rumors have swirled that he is possibly another one of 100's cousins. And judging by their social media posts, this may be goat true. Shit. Young goat shit. Big fucking goat. Your money boy. A 
put this fucking bag on these niggas' life, eh? <laughs> <laughs> these no fucking boys. These no fucking boys. Yo, yo, you don't, yo, you haunted, you don't know, fam. We just gotta, we gotta shit on the hops. Yo, let me shout out what I, bro. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Let me <laughs> shout out, yo, yo, you guys go send this to fake watch busters. We don't lie on the run. man. Yeah. That nigga ain't locked up fighting two first degree murder. First degree two? Ooh wee. Sheesh. Friend. GG. Hello, boy. We G. Please don't approach me. Like, comment, subscribe, y'all. Crazy story. Wow. Hey, <laughs> nah, they tweak. They gotta do some more of these. They tweaking in Toronto. Send me some more Toronto, oh, y'all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Squeeze.